going on everyone? It's Cecile Suede and in this video, I'm gonna be taking all through my top three cutting diet weight loss recipes that anyone can make. So these are my favorite meals to make when I'm losing body fat and getting into the best shape of my life. They're super simple to make and I promise anybody watching this video can make it. But anyways, I wanna first off say thank you so much for all the new subscribers tuning into my YouTube channel. You guys are the best. You all are watching the videos. More importantly, you're gathering so much information. A lot of you are telling me about how much weight you're losing, you know, how much muscle you're gaining. I'm just so happy and appreciative at the fact that I can help you this new year accomplish your fitness goal. So if you have not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, what are you doing, man? Join the team, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell right next to it so you know when I upload new YouTube videos like this every single week. You do not want to miss out. We are gonna hit 1 million subscribers by the end of this year, baby. Help me do it. Anyways, with all that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get, I'm gonna get inside the kitchen and show you all the ingredients we're going to need for this cutting meal plan. So check it out, I've got all the ingredients laid out for today's cutting diet weight loss recipe. So this is going to be super simple, easy, cost-effective ingredients, but check it out. We're gonna start right over here on the very right side. So we've got some canned pumpkin puree, a cucumber, grape tomatoes, iceberg lettuce, fresh salmon, light mayonnaise, some light balsamic vinaigrette, Quaker quick oats, a jalapeno, some white rice, chicken breast that has not yet been cooked, reduced sugar ketchup, sriracha, chickpeas, and some low sodium soy sauce, and of course, I cannot forget, and I definitely will not try flipping this, we have some impact whey protein powder. So before I get started, the first recipe is going to be some cinnamon toast crunch inspired protein pancakes. You guys are going to love this. This has been a staple for me, especially pre-workout, but I would like to thank my protein because they're sponsoring today's video. So guys, everybody watching my video right now, you're getting hooked up with 55% off on myprotein.com. All you have to do is use the links in the description box down below and that code ACILVAP at checkout for 55% off your entire order. So if you do like the first recipe I'm about to showcase, you wanna make it yourself using this cinnamon cereal flavored impact whey protein powder, then make sure you check it out, linked in the description box down below. Take advantage of that 55% off sale for the next 48 hours only, okay? That's 55% off your entire order. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and start whipping up these pancakes. I really don't know what that was. Please disregard that. Stir fry. Sorry, amigos. <laughs> This is it. I think this is what's finally going to get me on the Food Network channel. But anyways, I just got done prepping up meal number one, which is the first cutting diet weight loss recipe that I really want to show you all. I literally have been making this for ages. However, I tailored the ingredients to make this more of a cinnamon toast crunch inspired protein pancake recipe. So check it out. This is simply made with four ingredients. All right, we have quick oats along with some egg whites, pumpkin, and then also whey protein powder. So this is cinnamon cereal flavored impact whey, again, by my protein. Make sure you check this out. Link to description box down below. Code of CLVIP will save you 55% off. This is my favorite flavor by my protein. They literally came out with it like two months ago and I've been obsessed and obviously created this recipe with it. And pumpkin puree is super cheap. You all can get this at your local grocery store. And I showed you all exactly how much of each ingredient you need to use to make this. So again, four ingredients. Also just two little additives that are optional. It's just some cinnamon and some zero calorie sweetener, which I did personally use. It makes it taste a little bit better. And obviously this is used for display. All right, I do not recommend you actually put this in your pancakes, but you need some extra carbs and sugar would be a good deal. But speaking about extra carbs and sugar, this is going to be my pre-workout meal because honestly, this gives me the best pump at the gym. And more importantly, this is so filling and satisfying. I do not think about food for the next like four to five hours after eating this. And if you are training within an hour after eating this, I promise the pump is insane. And look, I don't need to tell y'all, I'm gonna show you. So with that being said, I'm gonna enjoy this. See y'all at the gym for an epic workout.
effective and strategic workouts done with purpose. Join the team today. Click the first link description box down below to get involved, but be ready to put in the work because this is simple, but it's not easy. back in the gym and I'm dying to show you all meal number two in today's cutting diet healthy weight loss recipe. So this is killer my friends and so many of you are going to love it. So this is going to consist of six ounces of cooked cubed salmon with a cup of cooked white rice, half an avocado, some sliced cucumbers along with some sliced jalapenos on top. So a lot of you are probably wondering what in the world is that sauce on top? Well my friends this is healthy low calorie macro friendly yum yum sauce. So check this out yum yum sauce is typically like 15 to 20 grams of fat for just one serving my friends this has around 10 calories per serving and honestly tastes just like it check that out so it was made with just five simple ingredients a tablespoon of each Greek yogurt sriracha reduced sugar ketchup low sodium sodium sauce low sodium sodium sauce holy crap yeah try saying that 10 times we also have some low calorie reduced fat mayonnaise and that's it we have whipped up an epic salmon dish however this is more of like an Asian inspired vegetable spicy salmon bowl I don't even know what to call it to be honest a poke bowl. Yeah, there we go. A bodybuilding poke bowl. Look, give this a try. You're gonna love it. Tag me on Instagram at Asil Suede when you do give this a try. And uh, let me know what you think of it, especially the sauce. <laughs> Moving on to the last and final cutting diet weight loss recipe, which is honestly one of my favorite, despite being super simple. But this is going to be a chicken cob salad. So check it out. This is going to consist of diced iceberg lettuce. We have six ounces of cooked chicken breast, two sliced hard boiled eggs, half an avocado, half a cup of grape tomatoes. There's supposed to be half a cup of canned chickpeas in here, but I could not for the life of me find the canned chickpeas in this kitchen. So imagine there's half a cup of canned chickpeas. That is pretty much going to be it. And I also like to add two tablespoons of this lice balsamic vinaigrette, which is only six 60 calories for one serving and one serving is plenty trust me so this is going to be your end of day meal or typically for me at least while I'm cutting because it's very high in fat high in protein low in carb and it just sits well in my stomach and keeps me really full at night so I don't think about food when I'm in bed I really hope you all enjoyed this look guys for those of you that stayed this long a you are a real one and B I'm gonna give you all a little bit of a bonus as a thank you so I'm gonna tell you all the total amount of macros and calories in today's cutting diet wait cutting diet I know it's you're thinking I thought these were just weight loss recipes well if you put all three of them together it honestly makes for a great cutting meal plan so check it out the total amount of macros and calories consisted of 2079 calories coming from 174 grams of carbs 78 grams of fat and 165 grams of protein so a lot of you all could seriously follow these three meals in just one day in this specific way I told you all pre-workout post-workout end of day and see some serious results but at the end of the day remember you do need specific calories and macros to tailored towards your own body. So if you wanna get access to recipes just like this, you can find it in my exclusive members only mobile app. However, you just have to sign up to my program. You can find that link to first thing in the description box down below. So definitely get involved and get access to all these recipes like you saw in today's video. And all of them are gonna be tailored towards your own body when it comes to the calories and macros. But look, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button right now. If you wanna see another one of these with different recipes, all right? And then also make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit that notification bell right next to it so you know when I upload epic, entertaining, and helpful videos like this every single week. Guys, this is the healthiest and happiest and most fit I have ever been, and I just want to pay it forward and help people feel the same way. So make sure you subscribe, tell your friends and your buddies about the channel. I do appreciate your support. We're gonna get to a milli, a milli, a milli together. I was going great until I said that. Thank you for watching. Follow me on Instagram at Asil Suede. Pretty much that's like my life in one big vlog through Instagram. Appreciate the support. I'll see every single one of you in the next video.